Hey, 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 folks, welcome to my channel. If you're here for the first time, welcome. My name is Martina, and for my regular viewers, welcome back. So, I just got some um, bread nut this morning. Um, in Trinidad, we call it chatine, right? So, I'll show you how I just wanted to thought I would show you how we prepare this, how we prepare it, and how we um, eat it, right? Um, this is uncooked, right? So, I'll just basically put it in a pot and let it boil, and then I'll show you next steps. So here I have some of the chatine in, in my pot. I'm going to fill this pot with some water and allow the um, chatine to cook properly. About 10 minutes, I'm going to put some salt and just let it boil some more. My husband loves chatine. He loves chatine. And we got this from St. Vincent. Okay, so here's the chatine on the stove, right? The process, whole process on the stove will take about, about 20 minutes, right, to fully cook. And yeah, now in Trinidad, we use the green chatine to make, to actually curry it and stuff. I think um, basically when the chatine, also known as bread nut, is more mature, fully grown, it looks like this and um, we boil it and eat it like that. Okay, so now that the bread nut has been boiling for about a good 10 minutes, I'm now going to add some salt. This is about two teaspoons of salt and I'm going to allow that to the boil for another 10 more minutes. I think I'll add some water to the pot. Because what's going to happen, the nuts going to sort of burst open a bit and absorb that salt. Okay, so here's the bread nut after boiling for about 10 to 15 minutes after I put the salt. So I'm, I'm going to turn off the stove, allow it to cool, and I'm going to show you how we eat the bread nut. Okay, so here's what the bread, looks, bread nut looks like after it's already cooked. So to eat them, just basically apply a little pressure between the fingers, peel, it, peel off the hard shell, and there's a thin coating over the bread nut itself. You can eat the um, this thin shell, or you can peel, peel it off if you wish, if you have patience. So you see that's the actual bread nut there, that kind of sort of a off color sort of thing like. You could peel off this piece, or you could leave it and eat it like that. And I'll just eat this piece. That's it. Doesn't really have much of a taste, but as I put a little salt, it has a little flavor with the salt. And that's it. Easy. In between, you get a, um, one or two that's not too good. It might taste a little bitter, it might be spoiled. Just throw away those. So I'm peeling off the hard shell. I'm peeling off the thin coating over the bread nuts. Again, I could leave that on. And eat it. That's it. Okay guys, if you enjoyed this video, click on the thumbs up button, leave a comment for me and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. And don't forget to click on the bell next to the subscribe button in doing so. You get a notification each time I upload a new video. Okay, thanks so much for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.